Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Now we are going to install a Facebook chat plugin to our website. Okay, and there are a couple of ways to do that and I'm just going to show you two of them. One is manually installing that and configuring it from your Facebook and then the other one is uh, through the use of a plugin. Okay, let's dive in. The first one is installing that manually. So I'm gonna head over on my Facebook page right here and then uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go right here on the settings and then we're gonna go on messaging right here. Okay, and we're just gonna scroll down below and as we can see right here, add messenger to your website. I'm just gonna click get started right there and hit next right there. And then from right here, we can see, we can uh, change the welcome message. I'm just gonna leave it as it is. Okay, I'm just gonna hit next. And then we can change the color right here. Uh, something like that, I don't know. I'm just gonna stick to green right there or probably the original blue from Facebook right there. And then I'm just gonna hit next and you're gonna add your domain right here. So I'm adding the uh, myfreelance101.com which is basically this domain right here. So that's good and once you add your domain, just hit save. And then all you need to do is copy the code right here. So this is the generated code. I'm just gonna click that so that is now being copied on the clipboard and I'm just gonna hit finish. Okay, I'm gonna hit done. Now I'm gonna go on my, on my uh, uh, website dashboard and what we are going to do is we're gonna paste that code within the footer of our website now there are a lot of ways to do that and depending on your team most likely uh, your team will uh, allow you to paste that code on a certain areas within the settings of your theme but for the sake of general public let's just do that on uh, uh, through installing a plugin. So what I'm gonna go, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go right here on the plugins. I'm gonna hit Add New, and I'm just gonna search for header and footer scripts. There we go, header and footer scripts, and I'm just gonna hit Install now. Okay, and I'm gonna activate it. And there we go. So that is now activated, and we're gonna go right here on the settings and click header and footer scripts. Now there are two areas, header and footer. I'm just gonna use the footer one. So I'm just gonna right click and paste. So that is the code from uh, Facebook that we have just generated and hit save changes right there. Okay, and now this is the front end of, end of our website. We're just gonna reload this one. And hopefully we can see that chat plugin right there. Okay, so you will now be able to receive messages instantly from your website through the use of Messenger plugin. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to do that by using a plugin. Okay, I already removed the manual installation of the script that we have just installed. And we're going to activate the chat plugin again using the uh, official Facebook chat plugin. Okay, so what I'm going to do is go right here on the dashboard and then on the plugins, I'm going to hit add new, search for customer chat plugin. Okay, so we got this one, messenger customer chat plugin, and that is from Facebook itself. I'm just going to install. And then I'm going to go ahead and activate that. And there we go. Okay, now what we're going to do is go ahead right here on customer chat right there. And there should be a generated code down below and this should be good enough. That is automatic and because I already set that up before and if that is not the case on your end, all you need to do is Click this button right here on edit customer chat right there. So this will basically link your Facebook account and 
we're just gonna select the page so I got a couple of pages I'm just gonna select the my freelance 101 hit continue and then we hit next and then it's basically the same thing that we saw or, or that we did on the other process so we're just gonna hit next the color right there and we're just gonna hit done and automatically the code is generated right within this area and all we need to do is hit hit save changes and boom that is it when we reload a page it should automatically display the chat plugin again so let's reload this one right here and there we go that is our chat plugin okay I hope that helps and if you got any questions please let me know in the comments below thanks a lot and please subscribe to my channel bye bye